Hey there! So here's a quick guide on how to fish in Disney Dreamlight Valley. Hopefully this guide will allow you to succeed 100% of the time in fishing so you can get as much money as possible by selling the fishes. First of all, you're obviously going to need a fishing rod from Goofy which you will get from advancing through the early stage of the story. Once you got the fishing rod, you are now ready to fish. Simply head to any of the ponds available in Dreamlight Valley and you'll want to take note of these water ripples. These are where most of the fishes are. Now position your character to look directly at the ripple. This is important because for the next step, you are going to want to cast your line onto the pond. Hold the square button if you're on the PlayStation and you will notice this small circle pop up going further and further away from you. This is where your line is going to be thrown into the pond. Now once the small circle is right on the ripple, simply release the square button and your cast should land on it no problem. Next up, just wait until the fish bites on your hook and then press X immediately if you're on a PlayStation. After that, just wait until the circle has shrunk till it touches the inner circle and turn green and then immediately press X once more. You might need to do this a few more times but once done, the fish is now yours. Now here are a few more important tips to keep in mind while fishing. First of all, you will notice that some ponds will either have blue or yellow ripples. This simply indicates that you can get a rarer fish from fishing it, hence more money for you if you manage to catch this and sell it to Goofy. Secondly, if you're having trouble with this part of the minigame, especially with a higher rarity fish where you will have to do it around 3 or 4 times, it is always better to just wait until the circle touches each other and then only press X if it turns green. Don't rush it as often times you will press it too early by accident therefore failing the fishing minigame. And lastly, do keep in mind that just in case you fail a fishing attempt either by pressing too early or too too late, you will still lose your energy every single time. So just make sure to follow this guide step by step and re-watch the video if needed to avoid wasting your energy. Hopefully this has helped you out in catching more fishes and earning more money along the way. More guides for Dreamlight Valley will be coming out for the next few days and feel free to like the video if it helped. And while you're still here, do check out these two videos as well as you may enjoy them as much as I did in making them. This is the Viper signing off, thanks for watching and as always, stay awesome and I'll see you in the next video.